Today we have Simone's three females. There is yellow ribbon female, so I'm gonna take a look here. She might have, yeah, her, she does have some lighter coloring on her paws. She may stay black and white, but I have a feeling that she's gonna start to get a little bit of color as she gets older. But just in case, she could be black, more black and white. Um, she has a wavy coat, so she'll be more of a wavy or curly coat, full grown. Hi, sweet girl. This litter is very calm and quiet and super sweet. All right, come here, pink girl. I'm gonna huddle back here. All right, so here's pink. Pink and yellow are very similar, except pink has a straight coat. So more of a wavy coat, full grown. So you can see all the white on her. And then um, where yellow has more of a wavy coat, so I'll hold them up together. So see the wavier coat on yellow and the straighter coat on pink. So pink will have more of a softer wave, full grown, where yellow could have a little bit more of a curl. Come here, teal girl. All right, and then there's teal ribbon female. She is a brown merle. So typically with brown merles, um, the coat, the lighter part of the coat will get lighter and then um, the chocolate stays. So you might have a little bit of a lighter color, full grown with keeping that dark chocolate. Um, she's got a lot of chocolate markings here and there on her leg. And she has a wavy coat. So we're expecting her to have um, more of yellow. Yellow and teal are similar coat colors where they're wavy. So probably between a wavy and a curly full grown. Hi, hi sweet girls. All right, you wanna play? These are a pretty average size mini litter. Hi. There you go. What do you think about the toys? See if you walk up and play. 